9197 Wolf Pack. This is your boy Tyler 9197, Witcher 9197, Black Wolf 9197, or 9197. Back with another video for you guys. And this time it's going to be part 8 of me playing Saga Nuts 2. And before I go ahead and start this video, I gotta say three things real quick. First thing first, hope y'all having a great day today watching this video. Second, God is good all the time, so please go ahead and remember that. And three, go ahead, hit the like, the bell, subscribe, so the wolf pack can grow. But yes, y'all, part eight of Saga Nuts 2. This is look, this, so for my knowledge, this look like it's gonna be the last one. Final walkthrough series of Psychonauts 2, which I am excited, but at the same time, I kind of wish it's not ending yet. But, but who knows? It might be a part nine. But, but at the same time, if I'm being honest, I kind of want this to be the last walkthrough part, just because, so I can make other, you know, make other content for y'all. Cause uh, I feel like I've been on Psychonauts forever. So, yeah, let's continue. All right, y'all, let's let's, yeah, let's go ahead and start. Came to talk. Excuse me. Agent Crawler? Clerk Crawler. Yes? How are you feeling? Busy. It's like nobody's been sorting the mail for days. Would you mind if I, uh, went inside your mind and sorted a few things out? Eh, I'm never opposed to anything getting properly sorted. Yeah, it's time, y'all. So hopefully this is it. Oh, that's cool. I was, in, <laughs> I was in an envelope. That was funny. Oh, so much mail. Okay, I think I think you're very good. Yeah, I think you're very good. Okay. Dear Ford, we brought peace to Grulovia, but there is still unrest among the people. A little ungrateful, I think. Home soon, Lucretia. Visit peaceful Grulovia. Maligula. Okay. This one, she was just Lucy. Oh wow. Well, if there's a piece of Ford's mind in here for me to reconnect, it'll probably be up in that giant clunky head. Hey, I came out of that clunky head. Really? Can you help me get in there? Uh, maybe. To tell you the truth, I'm not addressed very well, so I'm sure I'll be marked return to sender and sent back there soon. Just grab on. Did someone say return to sender? But this letter's got no return address. I'm afraid that means the dead letter office for you. But wait. I'm a heartfelt love letter. Don't care who you're quoted. The feelings must get sorted. Man, it's crazy, y'all. Oh my god. Look at all the mail and stuff. It's like it's like the river. That's crazy. Wow. Okay. Oh god. Oh no! Oh no! Look at the quote. Those comments. Letters, they just keep coming. What's the point? Nobody ever writes what they really mean. Okay. 
This is a whole lot. I wrote a letter once. Did I think I could stop a war? Ah, doesn't matter. I never sent it. Maybe it would have saved a thousand lives. Maybe just one. I wonder what would have happened if I'd sent that letter. I wonder if it's too late. Hey! Over here! Where? Oh. Okay. Let me get this stuff real quick. Yeah, but this is wild, y'all. This is looking so nice. <laughs> like... The creativity Quick, of Double Fine. Yeah, they really made a beautiful game. Like it's, it's just so creative. Just love it. Okay. Oh. I don't belong in here. If I get you out of here, will you still take me up to the head? Yes, but quick, before he... Whoa! Ah! Oh, my mistake. This doesn't belong in the dead letter office. <laughs> Look at that address. It belongs in the international dead letter office. What? No, wait! Uh-oh. All right. What? Oh, sans. I mean, sixers. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, whoa. Okay, hold up, hold up. Oh God. Hold a second. There, okay, there we go. Dang. The moving too much. <laughs> Okay, I think I, I think I got him. That it? Yeah. Good. Ain't that was annoying. Okay, I got my health back. Alright, good. Now I can continue. Like, how else I'm supposed to? There's gotta be something I'm missing, but Oh, okay. Ah, there we go. Yeah, I was wondering what I was supposed to do. I was confused. There we go. Lucy, your last letter frightened us. You don't sound like yourself. We're just worried about you. Love, Ford, and friends. All right. Just the Y button. That's pretty clear. Oh, God, I'm stuck. Okay. Okay. Keep 
report is almost complete. Just one key missing. But where is it? Okay, so yeah, so where is it? Do I have to go that way? I might have to. So that's not the what I need. Okay. So let me see. So Krulovia invaded. So she felt like she had to leave, which we already know that's Maligula. Maligula. I can't, I don't know why I can't say the name. For sad. So it was the dearest friends. The kids have turned. Have turned. We can. We can. Oh, 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 remember the tides have turned. We can win. Well, let's see. War is over now. The people are. Wait, the war is over now. The people are the problem. Lucy, what's it? Man, I've got. So what's this? Uh, Lucy. A lost letter. Oh, okay. Your my bad. Your lost letter. I could. It was hard to read because that curse. of your lost letter, fright on frightening us. You don't sound like yourself. We're worried about you. Love for and friends. Okay. He left. Is that country discontinue? Oh, but it was the letter that he never sent. Yeah, I didn't. So it was. It was like the letter that he never sent. Confused, like, so where is the last letter I'm supposed to find?
Okay, I guess this is going to take me up here now. Yep. So I can go right here. The people have a new nickname for me. They call me Malikula. Who sounds serious? I take it as a compliment. I like it so much, in fact. I can't remember being called by another name. Mm. Okay. That's what's crying. Oh, hey, I've uh, I, I know where it's at, but I don't know how to get to it just yet. So, uh. Oh, uh, there we go. Oh god. That's a matter of fact. Yeah, I'm playing. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. Uh fire. Come on. I'm... There we go, there we go. Alright. Get some health. Put a letter right here. Okay, just hold still. I'm gonna get you out of here. Oh no. <laughs> Some letters are such a pain in the neck, they really belong in the furnace. Wait, I think I know how to address this one. Really? Well, it's worth a shot. But don't take all day. The mail must sail into tomorrow. No time to borrow. Boy, I hope you know what you're doing. Oh, the other letter right there. Ah. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, no, 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 no. Yep. Oh, no. Oh, second. There you go. Oh, to close it up. Okay, yeah, because that's where I went to before. Okay. Then where's that one with the name tag then? It should be right there then. Okay, whatever. You know, I ain't gonna worry about it. I'm just gonna... Because I remember seeing it. But it's gonna pop up because I remember I saw it earlier. So it'll pop up later. Is that the missing typewriter key?
She's gone mad. She's flooded the capital. She'll destroy this country. Get out while you can. I don't want to go. I think I know who Ford would like to address this letter. To. Okay. Sure. Why not? I'm not sure about that, but if you say so, is it luck? Man, I hope it's luck. There you go. Oh, that's right. That's the name we all forgot. Now let's send that off and see what we get. It's not a body, it's still nasty. <laughs> this is a private mailbox. You aren't allowed in here. You've been missorted. You touch that, and it's a federal crime. What did you say in that letter? Nothing important, really. Just that I loved her. She just wanted to help, but they, they pushed her too far. Well, how should we have known? It's not like she was marked fragile. But I thought I knew her and everything she held inside herself. Ah, I had so much to learn. I guess some packages are better left unopened. Oh, that was the last piece. That four is going to be fully restored. Rasputin. Agent Crowler, how do you feel? I've done a terrible thing. And so have you. But what? we just wanted to undo what Maligula did to you. Maligula didn't do this to me. That's the first thing I've learned in here. The rest, you're gonna have to see for yourself. So he done it to himself? Ford, what is it? See for yourself. Okay. And he's not there. Okay. Oh God. you want to see this at all. That's crazy. Oh, what's in here? Oh. Hey, Ford, what's the deal with the Deep Six treatment? 
I did what I had to do. I loved her after all. Wait, what? Someday when you fall in love, you'll understand. Okay, okay, so I can't go that way. What's going on here? What did you want me to see? I couldn't let her go free. She was a danger to the world. Even though it was the world that made her dangerous. Lucretia? Where is she? Safe. She's safe. Well, she was. And we all were. <laughs> Not anymore. And in here, nope. Okay. Oh, that was kind of cool. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. That was kind of cool. I still had a levitation ball in the air, even though I'm uh, fall down from gravity. That was kind of cool. I did like that. Look, Ford. Whatever I'm supposed to know, just spit it out. I had to hide her from the world because they'd never forgive her. And I had to hide her from me because I'd never forget her. Where? Where did you hide her? She's with family. With family? I mean, cause she, I wonder, because... Because, I mean, she did put the uh, curse on Rad's family. No, 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 not again! Oh, wow, okay. Ha! Who's that? Now that's your grandparents, Laszlo and Marona. They drowned in the Valermo Dam disaster, remember? What? No! Grandpa Laszlo died there, but Grandma made it out and came to live with my father. No, Raz, she didn't. Ford, I just saw her today. No, you didn't. What? Wait, what? Hold up. Wait. Hold up, hold up, y'all. Wait, 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 wait. You telling me Raz's grandma is Maligula? Well, the pretend grandma? That, that will be wild. Oh, wait, so Maligula is the grandma? After the fight with Lucy. With Maligula? She was defeated, but alive. I snuck her away from the others and brought her back to the gulch. I put her in the astrolabe, one of Otto's inventions, created to make permanent alterations to the psyche. And I used it to isolate and neutralize the part of her psyche that was a murderer? Problematic. And I had my Lucy back. I think I hear some emotional baggage nearby. But I knew the world would never forgive her. So I had to hide her somewhere safe. Where, Ford? With Rash family? Oh, no. I hid her among her family, Rasputin. Among your family. No, no, no! That's what I was thinking. Yeah, she's just the grandma. I projected grandma. memories and feelings on your father so he would accept her. Accept Maligula? Yes. That's your grandmother. That's what I'm thinking. That's no! the grandmother? Is Maligula? Oh, wow. Oh my god, so grandma is Malik. Yeah, that's what I was guessing. I was like, hold on a second. He said, with family. I said, the only family I can think about is Rad's family. So, the grandma. 
is oh god, that's crazy. Let me go. Listen, Raz. I know you're mad. My great aunt killed my grandma. And so you made us babysitter for 20 years? Now look at you spring this news on your family now, their memories will unravel, and there's no telling how they'll react. So? They might try to kill her. If Lucretia is attacked, if she feels the need to defend herself, that dark spirit could reawaken inside her. Maligula really could rise again. You're right to be mad, Rasputin. I was young. I made a terrible mistake. But we need to deal with that after we get control of this incredibly dangerous situation. She's not there. Probably wandered off into the woods again. She keeps doing that. I know where she's going. The Psychonauts started out here, in the heart of the forgetful forest. There's a compound deep in these woods, protected from intrusion by psychic devices, traps, and illusions. I think Lucy's trying to get in. Trying to go home. Remember, mad later, mission first. Now stick close. I'll show you how to get through. Oh, he did say ants, so, but still, like, the ant. No. Oh, never mind. Oh, okay, whatever. But still, but yeah, hey, so. Brother? So, Maligula was the favorite to hold So, that's crazy. So, Maligula is, is literally in the family this whole time. Wow. That's really interesting. Wow. It's really all still here. The Great Needle Gulch. So much history here. I mean, this is where you assembled the team that would become the Psychonauts. This is where you first discovered Cytanium. Where Otto made his first psychoactive devices. Where Cassiopeia wrote her books. Where Helmut Fulbert workshopped his psychodicy. Bob Zanotto and Compton Bull pioneered communication with plants and animals. And where, where, I mean, this is where it all began. No, Raz, this is where it all ended. Where you are? What can you tell me about this place? I. Oh, I think. I think I used to keep the cinnamon over there. Oh, we don't have much time. Her old memories are coming back. What's going to happen? Listen, Raz. This compound? We got into some pretty far out stuff here. I've read about... The kind of stuff they don't write about in true psychic tales, okay? We all pushed each other to go farther, to broaden our consciousness, to open every closed door in our minds. It made us defenseless, psychically. But we were in a safe place here. We had each other. Then her homeland was attacked. She insisted on helping. I begged her not to go in that condition. It's so vulnerable. Ah, war brought something out in her that... Should have been locked away. Maligula. After the deluge, I brought her back here and closed those doors again with Maligula on the other side. How? With the astrolathe. 
a powerful tool we developed to make alterations to our psyches. That doesn't sound safe. Ah, you wouldn't understand. It was an age of exploration. But you're right. We were messing with powers we didn't understand. And now I have to clean up this mess. But I'm not the psychonaut I used to be, Rasputin. I need your help. What do you need me to do? First, I need you to go to the Heptodome and prepare the astrolathe. Well, I stay here and keep a close watch on her. Be right back, Nona. Away from the river, booty! Aha! I knew I had some chewing tobacco hidden in here! Okay. Sensing some stray thoughts around. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh my god. <laughs> what am I doing? Alright, there you go. I'll take that card. Oh god. Incredible. This is where the first Psychonauts met. And this must be the Astral Lane. Well, I'll just turn this thing on then. Well, those are thick. And thorny. Yikes! Okay, I'm gonna need a little help here. I'm not touching that thing again until I get rid of the bees and vines. Wait, oh, maybe, oh, fire, fire. Nope, that didn't do nothing. Okay. Is that the real Fieldmobile? Wow! This must be Helmet's Theater. Her Helmet's head must be cold. Oh yeah, yeah, the field mobile, yep. Yeah. 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 Oh, okay. Oh, okay, I was like, how am I supposed to... What's wrong, bees? Smoke get in your eyes. Witch, you don't exist. You're just something someone put into my mind. Which means there's probably a very powerful psychic nearby. Another hallucination. A very solid hallucination. Oh man, are you gonna cast a spell or something? Who are you? How did you get in here? And where was our security, eh? Cassiopeia? Author of Mind Swarm? Ford Cruller brought me through security. Ford? Ford Cruller? Came back? Oh, I knew it! I knew he would. But I'm not ready. I've been trying to fix this place up for him, but don't you know these bees are so demanding? Ford wants me to turn on the astrolathe, but it's covered in, well, really angry bees. Know anything about that? Oh, I think I can help you with that. 
I'm just happy to be useful again. Get out of my way. Ford needs me. Oh, I can tend to the queen later. Okay, okay. I'm sorry. She says I can't talk to you anymore. Wait! Cassie! Who's she? Those are some angry bees. <laughs> Cassie? Shh! They'll hear you! Cassie, would you sign my copy of Mind Swarm? I was wondering when you were going to ask. What took you so long? Thanks, Cassie. So, are you the Green Needle Witch? What? Why would you say such a thing? Because you're so pointy. Those are pine needles. They stick to the honey on my suit. I can't help it. Because you lurk through the woods in the dark. I do my beekeeping at night because this darn bee suit is so hot. Because you're so tall. Okay, well, I do wear lifts in this thing so I can reach the upper hives, but what beekeeper doesn't do that? No reason. Well, I'll admit, I have been playing into the legend a little bit. Why? I need to keep people away from here to protect it. This is a sacred place. What's up with these strange bee things? I've lost control of the bees. They're keeping me like a prisoner here. I'm going to help get you out of here, Cassie. Shh. Thanks. What are you doing out here by yourself? Why don't you work out of the mother load with the rest of the psychonauts? Oh, I never could adapt to the whole new psychonauts thing. I like to stay out here and remember the old days. Also, I want to take care of it as best I can, in case Ford and the others ever come back. Would you mind if I snuck a peek inside your mind? Oh, thank you. I haven't had a checkup since Ford went away. Okay, so this one will be interesting to see how this level gonna be. Now, to whom shall I dedicate this inscription? Not that many people find their way in here these days. You must have a good head on your shoulders. Uh, definitely a big one. Now, just imagine what you could do if you were using 175% of your brain. Actually, Cassie, I need your help with something else. We're on a critical mission. But there's a swarm of bees that's making it impossible. Stop right there, young man. Nothing is impossible. If you follow the 25 simple steps I've outlined in my book. Now then, let's go show these bees what we can do when we put our minds together. There's that pesky little volume. Thank you, young man. I have been looking for this silly book forever. Wait, she was going to help me. What? This one? <laughs> oh, I'll admit, the author was helpful once, when we needed the money to leave the country. But that was a long time ago. But when the chips were down and we needed to fight to protect our friends? Ah, worthless. Is there another Cassie book in there that could help me? They are all restricted. Hmm. Then again... Maybe I could help you, if 
you were to help me. There are two other books missing from my collection. Dangerous books. These are the books that got us into this horrible situation. These are the wrong books, you understand? Round them up for me. Take them out of circulation. They are overdue. Understand? Then you'll help me with the bees? I'll help you with the whole alphabet, Sonny. All right. I think I hear something. All right, dear. And what's this right here? Oh. Oh, God. Hey, you're not a child. No. Well, this shouldn't take too long. Embed supports negative thoughts. Sensors know when something's wrong. Kill the thoughts that don't belong. Seriously? Hmm. Oh, 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 I know. Hold on a second. Oh. 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 Sorry, but I. There you go. It's annoying. Hi, I'm Rats. And I am the Lady of the Lake, helper of knights on noble missions. Ooh, I'm on a noble mission. Can you help me? Sorry, already gave my sword to a handsome knight fighting a dragon. Having fun? Getting pretty sore, actually. This thing doesn't even have a saddle. <laughs> Hi. Memento Mori. Okay. Hey. Have you seen any runaway books? Uh, sorry. Smarts ain't my thing. <laughs> What's the axe for? Bookworms. They hate my family. Oh man. It's tragic. He said Book Wars and his family. Dang. Hi, what's your name? Guten Tag. Ich bin Gerda, the Pretzelmeister's daughter. Ooh, where's the Pretzelmeister? Papa fell into the pretzel machine. Oh gosh, I'm so sorry. Not to worry, it was his secret wish. Really? I think so. That's why I pushed him. <laughs> oh god. That's funny. Wait a second. I don't remember being in this book. Oh, it's so cool the way you do it. It's wild, y'all. Creativity is crazy. <laughs> Watch out! There's a giant, uh, you out there hunting for you. Don't worry, young man. The librarian can't get in here. That's why she sends in her operatives. Who, me? I'm not an operative. 
I'm just playing along with her until I find the real Cassie. The real Cassie? Tell me, child, what is your name? Rasputin. And tell me, who is the real Rasputin? The one you are with your friends? With your family? Or the one you say for your special someone? Hmm? Is that the real you? Or are you actually a combination of all those different identities? Important challenges in our lives can cause us to create entirely new identities for ourselves, sometimes summoning powerful archetypes from our unconscious mind. The hero, the explorer, the shadow. My special talent allows me to summon up whatever archetype I need to survive my current situation. Would you like me to teach you how? Focus your mind's eye on a vision. Vision of the archetype you need most right now. <laughs> that was difficult. Oh. Well, very good. Woohoo! You'll get better with practice. Da, 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 new power. Da, 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 da. Your archetype will act on its own sometimes, but you can also focus it on a specific task. Hey! Not now, I'm working! <laughs> Good dog. I think if I use projection on this door, my archetype would go in there. My oh, dogs are look at him go. <laughs> so cute. Ew, dusty! That's the spirit. What a good boy. See where this little fellow takes you. I'll meet you at the end. And then, I'll tell you my plan for the librarian. That's crazy. <laughs> hey, I know you. Aren't you from The Mind and Introduction? Yes, yes. Always nice to meet a fan. No time for autographs, though. Sorry. Wow. Conceited. Please excuse me. I have a lot of thinking to do. Hi there. Lob dub. What was that? Love dub. Love dub. Love dub. Uh. Love. <laughs> Why so glum, Dino Chum? Well, I'm from an old textbook, and it turns out I'm not considered a real dinosaur anymore. Please don't tell the librarian. She'll throw my whole book out. Okay. Uh. <laughs> the rest. <laughs> Don't you just love books? Yes, they're delicious. Hey, maybe you should try reading books instead of eating them. Read books? What is that? Some no fad diet? Oy. Sounds like a good way to starve to death. Excuse me. Yes. God. Are you in pain? To be free of the flesh is to be free of pain, my child. How did you lose your skin? I donated my body to medical science. I had no idea this is what they had in mind. Yikes. Are you mad about it? Skin's actually a lot more trouble than it's worth, to be honest. I'm free of rashes, itching, pimples. Aren't you cold? Cold is a feeling of the flesh, my friend. No skin, no cold. You look like you could teach me a lot about anatomy. You bet. How's this for starters? There's one of me inside of you. Gross. Hey, that's insensitive. Why aren't you like dripping blood and stuff? It happens from time to time, but I just go over to the horror books and drip on them. They like it. Bye, muscle man. Bye, baggy old clothes boy. 
<laughs> Dang. Man, like, this, he acting like my fit is not that, like, that, you know, that's a clean fit. Like, come on now. Get my clothes trash? Man, get out of here. With the, with, the, with the coat and stuff? Like, this is a real look. Like, come on now. Let's it's clean over here. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I forgot. I wonder if I could use projection here. <laughs> New friends. No. All right. Uh. You sure you want to do that? Stupid enabler. Okay. Hold on. Let me. Oh, No good. They're under that enabler's token. Now it's a fair fight. There we go. Okay, I got him. That was annoying. Alright. That was freaking annoying. You don't bite people, do you? Only if their name is Ferris. Huh? Sorry, magnet humor. I'm missing a piece. Can you calculate its volume? No. Kids today. What are you a formula for? S sine waves. <gasps> hey, are you the formula for a general conical surface? No, I just clenched my belt too tight. Hard to breathe. <laughs> So, what are you a molecule for? I don't know. What are you a person for? Hi. What are you two up to? Shh. We're running away from our spouses to start a new life together. <laughs> oh my god. Hey, do you bite people? Periodically. Oh, yep. This is so funny, man. What's that sound? <laughs> I think I hear some emotional baggage nearby. Hey, you two. Not a good time. Nice sword. It was bequeathed to me by the fair lady of the lake, so that I may slay this dragon. What did I ever do to you? What are you guys fighting about? No idea. I was just chilling when the crusader here got all aggro on me. Let those be thy last words, worm from hell. Hey, can I borrow that sword? Yes, please take it. Nay, for tis my duty most holy to embed its steel into this deadly beast. See? What normal person talks that way? <laughs> Is there a way we could maybe de-escalate this situation? This guy and his horse are just straight-up jerks. <laughs> I agree, Silverwind. Dragons are a plague on our land. Mr. Knight? That's Sir Knight to you. Sir Knight? Maybe you should just leave that dragon alone? Have you allied yourself with the devil's winged serpent? Hey, kid. Don't worry about it. I already called the cops. 
I'm just keeping this weirdo occupied until they get here. Summon whatever reinforcements you wish. We'll need them to haul your stinking carcass away. <laughs> okay, buddy. <laughs> Maybe we should focus on what you two have in common. Like, do you guys like pizza? Oh, yeah. Me... me too. Well, that's amazing. I had no idea dragons liked pizza. Great. What are your favorite flavors? Pepperoni. Well, I usually get half and half. On one side, I like pineapple and ham, and on the other side, I like maidens and cheese. Oh, my God. Pineapple and ham is an abomination. I knew you were a fell beast. Will you two be okay if I leave? Yeah, don't worry. This guy's all talk. I am merely finishing up my pre-smoting prayers. Whatever. I think I hear something. There you go. Alright. Okay. What? Wait, oh, oh, I know what I can do. Oh, yeah. <laughs> because you're a girl, that's why. But it was interesting when I found out that uh, Raz is the uh, voice actor of Invader Zim, and uh, and then the little one is Gur. So that's actually pretty cool. escape plan let's see wait oh wait did she wait she printed illegal money or something I guess got arrested Okay. 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 There we go. Okay, there we go. Get yeah, all of it. Yep. Oh god, oh god, okay, hold on a second. Oh god. Ooh, that was close. Oh, messed up. Suitcase tag. Gotcha.
couldn't he get over there? to work together so well really inspired me and it gave me an idea we need to get all of cassie's archetypes together round up all the runaway books and give them to the librarian but she'll lock you all up oh don't worry we won't be in them we'll be with you now go find the others hurry the teacher's edition we all learned so much from this one but we can't have her making up new identities and confusing things right when i'm getting everything sorted can we so Mr. No, more we can't just one more book to go you're right on the edge of becoming my favorite assistant his masterpiece Are you William Shakespeare? Forsooth, etc. Oh, wow. You really talk that way. No, I just like to give the fans what they want. Huzzah. I'm Raz. What's your name? Say my name, and I shall release the child. Shorty? I shall turn you into a frog for that. It doesn't matter anyway. I thought the baby was creepy. So I sold it to the Pretzelmeister. Oh, that's funny. Is this not my real name? Hey, it's not raining in here. Oh, this is just a passion. It distracts people from my nose. Very scary. Oh, you think so? Why, thank you. That really makes my day. Ugh. Don't really talk that way. Oh, sorry, I. They talk like this. Trying to see if I could get that one right there. Dang, I was close. Wait. No! Oh, man. Come on now. I almost had it. Excuse me, Ms. Witch, but can I borrow your magic wand? Sorry, Sonny. I'm just roasting a marshmallow here. <laughs> I get that later. Oh well. Or probably not at all. Oh well. Well, this one looks easy. Uh oh. I think I just jinxed it. here but be careful this is the shop of fanny flats the famous counterfeiter cassie works for a counterfeiter i work for myself but i do what i need to survive after our parents dumped us here 
We needed an archetype that was a little more thick-skinned. Cassie, we've come to bust you out. Did someone say bust? What was that? Huh? Shh! Never say bust in here too loudly. But it's true. We have a plan. Oh, hey, Teach. Listen, now's not a really good time. Flats has a big deal coming up, and she's really on edge. And I'm working on my ticket out of here. Can we help? Listen, don't tell anyone, but the cops are closing in on this place. The boss's days are numbered. I cut an immunity deal for myself. I just need to get them some evidence they can use against the big gal. But she's watching everybody like a hawk these days, and I can't get away. We'll do it. I'll get the evidence you need, and we'll b we'll briskly walk out of here together. Okay? Deal. But remember, never double cross a double crosser. Okay. Uh, okay. I need three pieces of evidence. We better split up. Wait, who am I talking to? Meow. Hi, kitty. Meow. Don't eat the fish. It's full of mercury. Meow. Okay. Officer. Hey, kid. Are you investigating Fanny Flats? Sorry, kid. Can't, you know, comment on an ongoing investigation and whatnot. So you are investigating Fanny Flats? I didn't say nothing. What are you investigating? Well, I'm thinking of investigating weird little kids with goggles who've recently drifted in from out of town. Any idea where I can find some evidence of Fanny Flats' crimes? Corruption runs deep in this town, kid. You can find evidence of it everywhere. Especially in the fish cannery, the print shop, and the market. What would you do with evidence if you were to hypothetically find some? Oh, we'd use it to put the squeeze on Fanny, of course. Like, legally speaking? Yeah, yeah, totally legal squeezing. I'll let you get back to work. Stay out of trouble, kid. Wow, this carving is beautiful. Why, thank you. We would have done more, but we got full. Hi, Worms. Yo! Do either of you know which way the fish cannery is? Yes, over there. Well, we take you there, but the smell is out of control. Which way to the print shop? Oh, you do not want to go over there. They're counterfeiters. Shh. How can I get to the market? That's way over there. Don't bother. Prices are nuts. What do you know about Fanny Flats? Ah, she runs this town with her fake money business. But she doesn't control us bookworms. Every time she tries to cut us down, we just multiply. Do you have any evidence that incriminates Fanny Flats? Oh yeah, we just uncovered a big juicy piece of evidence this morning. Can I have it? We ate it? What did you expect? Okay, bye. If you see any juicy evidence, please don't eat it. Okay! okay. <laughs> All right, guys, I am back. I had took me a little break, but I'm back, and I'm going to continue off where I left off from. And uh, if I could recap real quick, I think what we found out Maligula is uh, Nana, 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 and uh, we got to get Cassie. Yeah, that's what it was. But all right, let's, go, let's continue. Okay, yeah, I already talked to the bookworms, so I gotta go to three areas. Um, I'm trying to think. Which one should I start off? Maybe right here, because it's the closest. I need to find some evidence, quick. Slow and steady. Wins the race? Wins the... Race? Evidence. <sighs> Wait. 
Oh, oh yeah, I forgot. Hold on a second. Let me, uh, yeah, use my powers. Oh, crap. Hold on, I gotta try that again. But I really wanted to get that though. Alright. Oh my god, can I get it? There it uh, Okay, never mind, I guess. I guess I can just... Hold on a second, I just had it! Okay, come on! Oh, okay, I see, I see how I can do it. There we go. evidence. I think that's the best evidence I'll find in this part of town. I should check out the other name. This nugget is saying to me, take me away. Alright. Okay, that's done. So... Let me see the next one. I guess I had to go go right here then. Yeah, that's what I'm guessing. That's the hat box tag. Okay, I got that. So, yeah, I should get it. Woo. Okay, I made it. Wait, oh, okay, I see.
Oh, so there you go. Oh god. Fish market is clean. For a fish market, I mean. But just dirty enough to have some juicy evidence, I'll bet. I don't need carp. Carp is garbage fish. Carp they haven't named yet. Fish with worms. Catfish here. Also have carp accessories. Carp sweaters, carp leashes, fermented fish, packs of fudge. Day old catfish is even better for you. Carp for pets. Terribly old and rotten fish here. Catfish will help you grow a beard. Carp poetry, carp music. Fish that's past its prime. Come get catfish. Dang, I'm and messing up. Carp oh. air freshener. There you go. Stanky fish. Put catfish in shoes to cure flat feet. Carp that looks like octopus. We gold fish. Don't eat trout, or you'll get gout. Carp seasoning. Rotten fish. Catfish will make you taller. Carp keychains. Fishy fish. And by fishy, I mean it's fresh. Hi, I'd like some carp. Don't have any. What's that on your back? Plastic samples. I'm just doing test marketing. Tell me, how likely are you to buy carp in the next 10 days? Somewhat likely. Thank you for taking our survey. You've automatically been added to our mailing list. Oh, great. I think I smell some ripe evidence nearby. Better investigate. I'll have some catfish, please. One catfish-ish coming up. Catfish-ish? It's so close to catfish, you can't taste the difference. Never mind. Catfish will make you smarter. Carp extract. Terribly old and rotten fish here. Hey, what's a panda bear doing in a fish market? Dying fish? Just like everybody else. My catfish is buttery and sweet. Sorry, but why would anybody want to buy rotten fish? Listen, all the fish in this market is rotten. I'm the only one telling you the truth. Fair enough. Let's see. Okay. This is really creative, y'all. I can truly say that. This is like very creative. Like. Oh, they could have got some. Uh, I was saying, like, some Chinese music on it. I was like, okay, Psychonauts. A little bit, a little something, something. It was sound a little nice. I like it. So almost out of here. Oh god. Well, I wonder. You know, yeah. I was say I want to get that. <laughs> really, I wasn't planning to, but I was like, well, because I'm already close, so why not? There you go. One more piece of evidence to find. Okay, so.
All right, and then this area is over there. Okay, I was like, how am I supposed to get over there? Okay, I think I found out how. So I can drop off right here. It's hard messing up like this, y'all. I don't like it. Oh, God. Second, whoa, 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 just went out of print. Wait, what am I doing? Oh yeah, collecting evidence. I've got to stop saying that so loud. All right, let's see. Oh, 
Hold on a second. Okay. Where am I? I think if I use projection on this door, my archetype would go in there. Nimbo! Nimbo! Yes! Got the duffel bag tag. Okay, let's see. Okay, so I have to go back now because that's the that's the only way I'm gonna get it. Cause I can't go nowhere else. Wait, oh, okay. I think I got. I think I. I think I know what I could do. There we go. Go this way, and yeah, that's how. That's how else I'm gonna get there. There we go. This looks incriminating. I think that's all the evidence Cassie needs. I got all the evidence I need. Better bring it back to Cassie quick. Cause I kind of forgot. That's all the evidence we could get. Think it's enough? Let me be the judge of that. Oh, yeah. This is some hot dirt right here. We'll be able to blackmail her with this for years. Blackmail? I thought you were going to arrest her. What? How is she going to make the money she needs to pay us from jail? But if she's not locked up and she finds out I was the one who sent her up the river... Hey, don't worry. We'll, uh, protect you or something. Let's beat it. This was a bust. What? Bust? Bust! It's a bust! Ah! Ew. Not a chapter of which I am particularly proud. Hey, she was forced into the outlaw life. Not that part. I just meant... Nobody likes a snitch. There you are, all safe and sound again. Thank you, young man. You were a little loud for my liking, but you got the job done. And now you'll help me with those bees? Oh, are you scared of bees? Well, I know of one place where you'll feel completely safe. Hey! Let me down! Of all the double-crossing... This was all part of the plan. It was? Yep. And I thought I was the tricky one. Oh my, we've come to a bad place. No, it's perfect. How is it perfect? Any place is perfect. When we're all together. Well, I haven't seen you in a while. We should never have let her split us up. When we're together, nothing is impossible. Well, that tears it. I hate to damage a book, of course. But that last line was too corny, even for a motivational speaker. We're not going to let you control us anymore. Oh, and which one of you thinks you should be in charge? None of you could stop Maligula. None of you could protect your friends. I am the real Cassiopeia.
And I'll show you how we fight off a foreign invader. Get oh. ready for the shushing of your life. All right. Die, brilliant. Oh my Help god. Here, will you? Having a bad day. Watch it. Oh, you put that kind, unarmed, and honest. I will silence you once and for all. Oh my god, really? Are you kidding me? Try throwing this at her, Raz. Then that will cheese her off at least. I just remembered a book I wanted. Somewhere in these shells. Who threw that? I feel a little dog eared. Oh, Raz! Get that gate open so I can work on her from the inside! to the story. What's going on? Who's in here? Hello, Cassie. You? The self-righteous little writer? What are you doing in here? We writers are most effective when we get inside someone's head. Oh! Ah, it's you! See, huh? I might be able to upgrade my build. Oh, I can. Hold on a second. Let me upgrade this. Okay, cool. Powers, but okay. How do you know, can you? Give me your honest opinion on how I'm doing so far. Whoa, whoa. I think what my swore would say about this situation is this book changed my life. Incredible. Oh. 
Oh, that was a cool okay. Oh, oh, oh. You Got her before she did it. On the run. Get that gate open, kid, and I'll bust this whole crooked operation. Okay, and. Kid, we're one of a kind. Get that and gate open. Get me over there. Okay, time for the money maker. Okay. Oh no. No, no, no. Something's not right. In fact, you could say something stinks. You! Oh no. I can't handle all three of you at once. That's kind of the point. Ready, gals? I'm ready. Together now! I can't believe I failed. Again! I guess, I guess I'm not the real Cassie. Yes, you are. And so am I. Me too. Mostly when we need money. Hey, I'm pretty good in a fight. You might have noticed. Are you the real Cassie? Hmm, not sure. But I'm sure she's in here somewhere. Now then, did you say something about my bees? That was a really good one. Oh my, they really aren't behaving, are they? That's it. I'm all out of bee puns, I promise. Think you can do something about them? I'll try. But I feel like I've... lost a little control of them. Oh, how I wish my old partner were here. I think they just need a nap. Oh, bully! How did you know I needed you? A little bird told me. Oh, sorry, I should say three little bees. Well then, think we can get this swarm to stand down? I do. Bedtime for bees. Jars of honey and no one to give it to. Come on. Okay, scary part's done. Now we just have to get rid of those vines somehow. Hey, can you guys help me get those big vines off of the astrolabe? Sorry, but plants are Bob Zanotto's area of expertise. Yes, I've always found them rather... Thorny. <laughs> oh, bully. 
Yeah, that's what I thought. So I was like, that sounds like, yeah, Bob, that's the only one. That is, uh, who was it? Oh, yeah, um, Helmet's, uh, love interest. Yeah, yeah, that's his love interest. So I gotta find Bob to help you with the vines and he gotta be yeah, he I know for sure he's over here. Yeah, and that's the last person. That was all the second knots. Cause I already helped four now all that. I got them straightened out. And now I left his Bob and now I guess I had to go through his yeah, yeah, I gotta go through his uh mind. It's a picture of the psychic six. I mean seven. All right. Agent Zanato? Bob? Hey, that just missed me. Well, his aim ain't what it used to be. You could give somebody a concussion. Yeah, well, it was your choice to come in here uninvited. It's dangerous in here. Lots of uh, broken things. Your nephew, Truman, sent me on a mission to put Ford Crawler back together and Helmet Full Bear. Stop it! Right now! I don't want to hear any of those names ever again, you hear me? They're all lost. Dead. But, Bob. Especially that one! Uh, uh, Ow! You're lucky I'm wearing a helmet. Bob would mind if I took a look inside his mind? Okay, so Truman is uh, Bob's nephew. Ah, okay, I okay. I thought I was like his brother or something. So, okay. Hello, Agent Zanato. Hello. Agent Zanato? Strange. I don't usually get visitors here. That sounds pretty lonely. I have my garden. Of course. The Zanatos are famous for their... gardens. Huh. What did you plant here? Plant? What kind of seeds did you use? Oh, seeds. Yeah, that's right. No seeds. Lost them all. Where'd they go? Out there, I suppose. Can't really remember. Well, let's go find them. I'm uh, not a good swimmer. Are you? 
No. Welcome to the island, then, I guess. Let me see. Yeah, I never can't get too far. Oh god. Yeah, never can't get too far. Oh, what about that though? Oh, okay, never mind then. Never mind. I'm I guess I gotta leave. Yeah, I, yeah, I guess I gotta leave right now. Huh. Oh no. Oh the door. Yeah, okay, yeah. Wait. Don't go. Come with me. It's okay. Look, I'll just do some quick seed recon and then I'll come right back. I promise. Damn, I, I ain't gonna lie, I kinda felt that a little bit when he said, he said don't go, like, that's that, like, you know, someone real lonely. It's like, it's like, dang, like, he needs a friend type thing. I kinda this felt that a little bit. And ominous. Prominous, if you will. Oh, pictures. Mom, it's time for my recital. you to get hurt how could that little thing hurt me oh they always start out little don't they and then they grow and grow and cause so much pain here let me just take this somewhere safe wait no I want that no you don't <sighs> great of course oh hi there uh Lend a hand. What do you need? Uh, just uh, caught in a bit of a bind here. If you could jiggle me loose, I could get some fresh air on my face. I'll work it out. Just hang in there. Was that a joke? Because uh, I didn't ask for any jokes. Okay. Ah, that's the stuff. Yeah, a little motion really gets the juices. <laughs> oh, God. If you know what I mean. Hang on. I'll break that final vine. No, 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 no. Just leave it. I, I think this is all the freedom I can handle right now. How'd you get yourself caught by that bird? Caught? I got this feathered fairy service right where I want him. 20 feet in the air? He's keeping me moving so I don't plant roots. It's a constant struggle. Okay, let me see. I'm tempted to just let you get hurt. <gasps> Yeah. 
Stay away! For your own safety! Oopsie! Let me get this out of your way! Okay. No! What? What? Man, come on now. I'm really warning good? you in a friendly way. Uh huh, yeah, whatever, sure. No! Oh, I, I know I know what I was trying to do. Uh, uh oh, okay, okay. You don't want to be near this thing. This moth get on my friggin' nerves! Okay, hey. next time I'm really going to hide this. What? <laughs> it was in my way! Alright, 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 enough playing games now. Alright, let, let me get this. You almost touched it. There we go. I feel like I, feel like okay. I couldn't get that. Don't get so close. Let me untie my the black jeans. Okay, there you go. Uh, <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> Hang on, that, that was funny. Let <laughs> Tarzan. Hey, I can see your house from here. Is it green? Where does this ride end? Oh, great. I'm messing up too much. Hi, have you met my friend? They just love to fly and fly. Okay, hold on a second. All right. Wait a second. What am I doing up here? I think I hear some emotional baggage here. Can't do nothing for it. Does anyone help? Oh, I Okay. Name for me this monster so roughly bearing me over the sea. Oh, of course, now I got a duffel bag tag. Okay. I hope you're not taking me back to your nest to, uh, feed something. There we go. So sick. You spend so much time on them. It's almost like you want to get hurt by this thing. Starting to think you don't trust my opinion about seeds.
Looks like my plant friend is caught up in some regrets. What are you talking about? I have no regrets. And these must be somebody else's. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Oh my god. Oh man. Oh, I forgot. Yeah, I forgot when you die, it does kick you out. Uh. Okay. Cool. Glad they did that. Hmm. Looks like my plan. Put me down, wretched demon. Oh my god. This must be Bob's mother. It's not my day. She is an auto. I'm starting to think you don't. Uh, hey mom. Are you heading out to the greenhouse again? What are you doing out in the greenhouse for so long? That's a little foreboding. Oh, yes. Only very bad things down there. Perfect place for this. Oh, come on. You'd better leave Bob's memories alone. You don't want to bring out one of his bad moods. What's so dangerous about a bad... Uh-oh. Look, Mr. Mood, I'm sure we can work this out. For instance, let's examine the source of guys. So you gotta fight it. <laughs> Not working. fire wait clairvoyance oh, it's immune to clairvoyance right now Okay, so maybe you could have at least asked first. Almost had it. I just need to focus a little longer with my clairvoyance. Hey, lady, look. 
There must be something causing this bad mood around here. Interesting, interesting, interesting. But it does really go deep of like how they go like like certain things people go through from mind things, how they feel, like regret, anxiety, all this stuff. This is something how double fun put it all in psycho on us and dug deep deeper than he did the first game. Time. Are you still out here? Wow. So this must be Lily's great grandmother. Uh oh. Moths know, right? Okay, that's one. I think it's three. Yes, yeah, three of them. Because there's one, it'll show him a helmet. Which you already know, but that's his love interest. One was his mom, a helmet, and then I guess the Psychonauts. Yeah. Look familiar? I don't know. Looks big. Let's plant it and see what happens. Nothing happened. <laughs> Guess it's a dud. Agent Zanato, as an expert gardener, I'm sure you know the value of patience when it comes to... Well, hello. I'm off to find more seeds. Uh, well, don't you think this is enough? More's always better. I'll be right back. Okay, I guess it's showing me the next one I gotta go to then. Guess this is gonna be... I'm no plant scientist, but that looks pretty seedy to me. I guess this one gotta be helmet now. Hey, you okay over there? What? Uh, me? Oh, I I'm great, thanks. Oh, okay. Thank you. 
I feel much better. Sorry about that. Cabbage burps are the worst. <laughs> Thank you. This is where I get off. Thanks for the lift. Oh, poor step off. You're welcome. What? For saving you from that time bomb. It's just a seed. Ah, but isn't a seed just a bomb in slow motion? In the mother world. That would be before they paid for landscaping in Harrow. Now. Okay. You do this! I have uh, no. Not the you! Causing this bad mood. All right, all right, let me at him, let me at him. Where'd they go? Hey, where's the seed? What seed? Oh, that thing. Oh, I dropped it in a river far away. Right. Hey, it's not in there. Not in there, I said. It's clearly in there. Come on, killer. I'm taking you along for protection. Good idea. It's you and me, kid. Let's show them who they're messing with. Over this way? Oh, great. That, that's exactly what I would have done. I haven't been over here in a while. Well, you know, I didn't think about it. Too bad mm -hmm. Raz just can't use his telekinesis just to pick him up. Watch it. Ow. Oh, 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 sea urchin. Oh, God. Slippery stuff here. They really ought to put down some yellow cones here. I uh, don't suppose you have any golf shoes on you, huh? Something with uh, cleats? If you start slipping, remember to lean into the slip. Oh, wait, is that. Or maybe it's away from the slip. Careful. I think one of these tiles is loose. Oh, okay, no, I see him. Did I hear a crack? Who wants your step? A little grout would do wonders for this floor. Step lightly, young ward. Oh. I know how I can lighten the load. <laughs> Did that help? <laughs> <laughs> on a crack, oh my God. The old man's back. 
That was fun. Look down. That was funny. I know how to light up the load. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> that must be Rick. Or Rick and Morty. But yeah. Careful. I think one of these tiles is loose. Oh, here's my stop. Ah, uh, being back in this place really brings up some. <clears throat> Brings up some. <laughs> memories. Oh, are you headed down to the boss's office? I do not envy you. Fired. You can't fire me. I helped create this place. Recruited by Ford Crawler himself. No pipsqueak nephew's gonna fire me! What do you mean, what's happened to me? What's happened to you? Ooh, yeah, that sounds real. What's this phone sure. number? I'm not gonna call some stranger. I don't need help! I just need my job! Yeah, I made some mistakes, but uh, so is everybody! Yes, yeah, it's, it's real deep. Yes, people were hurt, but no one died. It worked out in the end. Why are you all attacking me? You're my own blood. Why aren't you on my side? Truman, how could you? Dang. Yeah, it's deep. I'd hate to see Truman get that man. Got another one. This is going great, don't you think? I'm off to find more seats. So there's only one more left. And that's hell, man. Now, just hang on there. What? What's wrong? I wasn't doing anything. You weren't about to grab that seat. <laughs> grab that what? Oh my god, I didn't even see that. Let me grab that. No, wait! Thanks for the tip. Uh, I, mean, I mean, it was gonna happen anyway, but Thanks still. For the lift, by the way, I didn't catch your name. Oh, it's over here. Let's see. I'll take this nugget.
Oh. Hold on. Let's see. Was it T.S. Greenhouse? Let's... I guess he lost his father. His mom died after a while. Yeah. So I guess she, she, she just passed away. You go to the greenhouse. Is that like beer, wine? Which probably made him become an alcoholic. Yeah, I think that's what it was. Like, it's on, it'd be some deep stuff, y'all. I, I really do feel people, people, like, especially the ones who don't play Psychonauts, it's like, you can't, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's definitely, it's not as much of a kiddie game people make it seem like. It may have that appearance, but it's definitely not. Glad you could come. I love a good wedding, don't you? Now then, to the champagne tower, my good man. Oh, so he proposed to from above. Almost. Oh, I was like, what? There's no <laughs> I just need to focus a little longer with my clairvoyance. What? Okay, all right. Oh, uh, I... take me back to your nest to uh, feed something. Oh, okay, so he proposed to Full Bear. Man. Hi, have you met my friend? They just love to fly and fly. Don't get so close. Wait, no, I want that. Wait a minute. I don't know about this place. It's cake? Yes, yeah, cake is different flavors. Helmet <laughs> and, and Bob, yeah. So that no one but Oh god, ow. Oh god, dang. What? Oh my god. How am I struggling this much, y'all? Oh my goodness. There we go. Finally got it. of this bad mood, maybe I can get rid of it. Wow, remind me not to invite you to my wedding. <laughs> I think I hear something. But he would just... Suitcase. 
That's what I need here. Man, that moth was just jealous of my skills. That's all that was. Grass has skills, man. Oops. What's this? Oh. Alright, uh. Look, I've already given Bob two of those seeds. They're harmless. You... what? You have no idea the harm you've done, do you? Time to get serious. I'm running out of places to hide this thing. Ooh, this is good. Nobody actually eats wedding cake, right? Well, I like wedding cake. Down here, kid. Get me out of here. I don't want to miss the ceremony. Oh, where are Appreciate you offering to carry me down the aisle. My uh, regular carrier broke a wing when we crashed into the Champagne Tower. I'm fine though. Didn't feel a thing. Takes a lot to crack you know this what? old man. I don't think I'm ready to go in quite yet. Why not? Oh, yeah, that's good. I'm feeling a little off, and I don't want to ruin the ceremony. <laughs> See what I mean? Oh man, it just it got dark real quick, did it? Cause you saw the skull on full bear face. It got dark real quick. plants more than people until I met this man when these feelings appeared in my heart I thought they were weeds and I tried to pull them out but this mighty oak has given me shade shelter and something to lean on when I needed it just when I thought I was turning to seed you made me bloom again I do Good to see you again, Helmet. I'll make sure this gets back to Bob. So him and Helmet got married. That's what it seemed like. I mean, what not seem like, that's what it is, so, okay. Yep. Cause I knew it was a thing, but I didn't know they got married. Well, Bob, you did it. Yep, I did it. Why so nervous? I'm just, 
I'm starting to remember why I got rid of those seeds. I warned you, and I warned you, but did you listen? No! But don't worry, I'm here to protect you. Again. Hey, what are you doing to him? Leave him alone! I'm protecting him! <gasps> protecting him? From what? You're about to find out! Uh, dang. Okay. It's like that, huh? Careful. Troubled waters ahead. <laughs> Those seeds were bad news. Oh, now you've gone and put him into a bad mood again. I've had enough giant oh, 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 oh. You think you're his I don't think oh, I'm hurting oh, oh, oh. at all. You make it so hard for me to do my job. <laughs> Everything is so bad. <laughs> I think I need to figure out what's causing it. Stop doing that. You make it so hard for me to do my job. I can't deal with that bad mood until I figure out what's behind it. Let's see if we can get to the heart of this bad mood. give up? And let me. Uh... No shame. Is supposed to hurt this much. It doesn't need to hurt at all. Doesn't need to hurt you, I mean. Okay. Bombs away. Oh, did I say bombs? I mean, treasure. Oh, <laughs> 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 
Not so bad at gardening yourself. Think you can handle them now? Willing to give it a try. How about those? Well, I'll just take them one at a time. Yep, all the bottles in the blue bin. Bottle caps, too. Hey, that too. We're recycling plastic now. Can you believe it? So, uh, Agent Sonato, think you could help me with a little... yard work? Wow, what a mess. Yeah. I mean, it's impressive as far as strength and mass, but in terms of aesthetics, it's all over the place. You talking about the vines or that beard? Who's this? Helmet. So this is where you ran off to. Figures. What? It's me, Bobby. It's your psyching. But how? Where's your body? I was lost for a long time. Until this one found me. Body's on loan from the mailroom. Hang on. Borrowed lips. Wouldn't be right. Yeah. And he's not as cute as you either. Well, neither are you right now. Come on, let's at least wash that beard. What's that smell? Mushrooms? You know I hate mushrooms. I know. All right, prepare. Who knows what you will find inside Nona's mind? Be sure you are ready before activated. Okay. Okay. I have a feeling I'm about to get into some heavy business. 
Am I sure I'm ready for this? I'm ready for whatever might happen. Took you long enough. It still works. Of course it still works. Otto over-engineers everything. Crawler, I, I think that's the nicest thing you've ever said about me. Otto, you're looking well fed. Ford, you sound like your old self. Well, some things are clear to me now that weren't before. But come on, there's a lot to be done. I don't know who's the tr who's the mole though. Ford, Ford, is it really you? Cassie, Compton, and Bob. I'm. I'm. I'm happy to see all of you again. What's Nick from the mailroom doing here? That's actually Helmet Fulbear's brain in Nick's body. <gasps> I do love making a grand entrance. Sounds like Fulbear. He's in there, all right. But where have you been? Uh, you don't want to know that. I've missed you so much, Big Bear. I never thought I'd see everybody together again. Well, almost everybody. Hey, I remember this place. We used to sneak in here and fool around on the beanbags, remember? Lucy. Hold on a second. Who was on the outside? Wasn't there that one girl that everybody ready? Intern? She's the mole. The smart girl, because I was cause there was someone on the now, outside. This hunk of junk was made by Otto Mentalis. So uh, there's no telling what might happen. Oh, what can I say? I was underfunded back then. But if everything goes well, we might be able to have our dear friend Lucretia back in the circle. For good. Now. You ready? Kind of. <laughs> Me too, kid. She gotta be the mole. You gotta be her. That's what I'm thinking. It has. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my great pleasure to present to you the high flying, death defying, ironically named Aquato Family Suckers. Augustus, Don Nutella, Dion, Crazy, Rasputin, Murtala. And little baby creepy. And the most important member of the family, one who's been here the whole time. Nona Aquato, right where she belongs in the heart of her family. What is this? 
It's a mental construct I made for Lucy to convince her that she was your grandmother and that she lived with you. Come on, it's time to get her out of here. A car well, it's, it's not what did you step in? I don't know. It looks like a puddle of goo. With a mask of me in it. Has anyone seen my brother? He was just standing here a second ago. Ah, uh, here he is. Oh, well, come on, Raz. It's showtime. You better play along with this, Raz. We don't want to upset the construct until we have control of its situation. I'll work on Nona. Can't Dion do this one? In my sleep? It's a better show if you do it, Rasputin. Because the audience isn't sure if you'll make it. And behold, the daring father-daughter team of Frazy and Augustus Aquattle. One will live, one will die. Maybe. Who knows? Only one way to find out. Yep. Round and round the wheel goes. Will Frazy kill her papa? No one knows. Okay. But oh, oh, this one right here. The only thing sadder than a child stabbing their parent is when it happens without an audience. Don't let this sacrifice be for nothing. All right. Okay. So. Okay. Really good. Okay. Let's see. The loot of Grulovia. Down will Gazar help us. Yes, Lucy. Or Maligula, whatever, whatever name to go with. I guess the war took so much toll, then that's when she became the Ligula. Come on now. Be a big girl and throw knives at daddy. I just. I just don't feel good about it after last time. Anyone can make a mistake, Frazy. But Papa, your leg! Now pick up a knife and throw it! I won't! You must believe in yourself, Crazy. No! Well, I guess I'll just sit here spinning like a windmill then. Good! Wondering where I went wrong as a parent. Dad! Crazy. 
Hey, Fleezy. Not now, Raz. I'm trying to get up the nerve to stab Dad. Ah, Raz, my boy. Toss that knife this way. Good job. Keep going. Well, duh. Bend your knees, look where you want the knife to go, and you've got this rescued. Come on. Oh my god. There you go. You did it, my boy. You're my favorite son now. Wait, what was that? Wow. Flea Dad tells it like it is. Okay, my turn to throw knives at Dad. Oh, the most functional family. <laughs> but at least they're all alive. Okay, all the children are safe. No? I will show you my little secret. Come with me to the high dive. dive in the Aquato family circus for years. You know, the curse. You know, the more I think about that curse, <laughs> the more I think it's a lot of provost knock. Now get up there. Wow, it's really up there. Jeez. Where? Nona, what are you doing? Getting out of here, and you're coming with me. Nona! Oh no! What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? Pause it. Not yet. <laughs> Circus didn't have a quilting area. I didn't make this. I created that two-bit flea circus to make Lucy forget who she was. But it looks like she escaped. Come on, Crowley, stinky dam is over this way. What? Guess you learn a thing or two when you live with fleas. Here's the steamer trunk tag. I'll take this nugget. Say no, no, wait, no, no's call for help. Who's that supposed to be? Ain't Lucy, right?
see Raz practicing um, telekinesis. Go to here, lady. What a oh, so let's see. Yeah, okay, yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot because he's doing his uh psyche psychic secret and that's the whole family. Wait a minute. Hold on a second. And that was Ford? Was Ford the one that gave Rash the, uh... Oh, okay. Okay, I just... Okay, I noticed from the top, Raz is using his power on Mart... Uh, Mart uh, Martala. Use his psychic, and that gotta be Ford, I believe. Wait, hold on a second. Oh, oh, never mind. Oh, so okay, no, she gave Raz the paper, so that's how his whole Psychonauts journey started. God, that okay, that wasn't Ford. Oops. What's this? It's Lucy and your father. Oh, this must be one of the first real memories she formed after the astrolabe procedure. Your father was put into an orphanage after his parents were drowned. I locked Maligula away, deep in Lucy's mind to make Lucy herself again. But then I got your father out of that orphanage, buried some of his more uh, traumatic memories, and brought him to her. Why? Well, they were both all alone in the world. The only family the other had left. My sweet little Gussie. Let's keep moving. Wait, wait! Wow, okay. There's a, there's a lot of stuff to do. <laughs> There we go. Let's let me get some health real quick.
Okay. This would be a sweet picture if I didn't know everybody was under some sort of astrolathe hypnosis. I never used the astrolathe on the rest of the family. These are real memories Lucy made for herself after I was gone from her life. Good family, excellent balance, very flexible. Not afraid of heights. Not like you, hey Crowley. Lucy, please! <laughs> gave me the pamphlet to Whispering Rock Psychic Summer Camp? You're the reason I became a Psychonaut? Well, it is even you are crazy, but you were such a nerd with those comic books. Hey, True Psychic Tales is a graphic non-fiction periodical. Some part of you knew you were living a lie. You sensed Raz's power. You thought he could help you. Oh, I don't know, Crowley. I get so confused sometimes. Usually I was happy, just sewing dance and stretching the children, telling them to stay away from the water. Then I feel oh, so sad. And just when I was about to figure it out, everything would start to unravel. I hate this place. This is it. This is where I locked up Maligula. Behind that dam. We need to unlock it and draw Maligula out into the open. Then we'll combine our powers and direct the astrolathe to blast open a pit into the deepest part of her mind. Why don't we just, you know, blast Maligula? Maligula is a part of Lucy's mind. A primitive part that may have helped her early ancestors survive. We all have our own Maligula Rasputin. We just know how to keep it locked up down below. If you can secure the area while I keep Lucy calm, then we should be able to unlock this dam together. Alright. And I know for sure. I don't like this place. Raz, I need to stay here with Lucy. Once you reveal the lock, we'll blast it. Hold on for me. Time for justice. Oh, 
That's enough positivity for now. Now, nah, now, nah, it's all right. <laughs> Yo, let me. Before I can get rid of it. Almost had it. Are you kidding me? of this bad mood, maybe I can get rid of it. I need the purse tag here. I think I hear some emotional baggage nearby. What's that sound? I need the purse tag here. Oh, okay. I think I hear something. I think I hear this guy needs a duffel bag tag. This hat box needs a hat box tag. Okay, don't got that one either. Okay. Okay, it's time to open it up. Oh. Okay. It's a locket. It's my sister, Marana. But, but, uh, Help me focus the astrolathe, Rasputin. Quickly!
Uh oh. We might have made a mistake. I think we made many mistakes. But now, we're gonna face them. I couldn't before. I was young, scared, and alone. But now, I'm only one of those things. Oh, she's grown. Let's hope the astrolathe can make a deep enough pit. Don't worry for it. I'll be right here beside you! Himmel. Jackpot. Bullseye. I felt her. Maligula. I know the identity of the mole. That's incredible, Sasha. Well, I had mechanical assistance, which you didn't need. <clears throat> Agents? We have a security breach in the Green Needle Gulch. She's here. So it was that glasses girls. Yeah, that, I mean, yeah, it was that glasses girl. It's okay. You were safe. What happened? We were... You were obviously in distress, so I pulled you out. Is that... her? I told you he was up to something out here with his girlfriend. Maligula. That's not his girlfriend, you little snitch. I'm his girlfriend. My god! Oh yeah, funny story. That's not really Nick from the mailroom. I know that, but why? Doesn't matter. I'll take it with me when I take her. Oh, I'm confused. I'm confused. Like, I don't know. Like, why Truman seems kind of fishy. That's where I'm like. That's what I'm trying to figure it out. Ignition critical psychonaut assets. Hand them over. Can I have my clothes back yet? Kid, you got a long way to go. Better get moving. Ouch! Better quit it. Kid, this is your last warning. Ow! Watch it! I hate normal so much. Truman, why did you pull me out? Ford and I about to face Maligula. Don't worry. I'm sure you'll get your chance. The way he said that, I don't like that. He says, let's go, man, I don't know, this is kind of messing my mind a little bit. Huh? Lily, Raz, listen, I've been following my dad for a while, and he's acting really weird. Let's get Sasha and Mia to help. But my dad might be gone by the time we get back. We need to get to the bottom of this. How? I need to see what's going on inside his mind. I need to go in. Into the grand head. You're right. We do. Wait. What? You're not going to make me do this alone, are you? Okay, Lily gonna join me. Okay, it's gonna be interesting. Oh my god, it's just so much going on, man. Wow. Jeez, get over yourself, Dad. What the heck? Right. Let, let's split up and compare notes in a bit. This is just... 
don't really think of your dad as a vain man. He's not! I'm telling you, something's not right in this stupid place! Hmm. Dad? Here are his outfits. That's pretty normal. In his mind? Have you ever seen my father? He never thought about his clothes. But... Huh? Hey, this statue! Careful, Raz. That's still my dad. Lily, take it from me. All dads are weird. I just don't know what's wrong with him. Strange. Wait, oh, okay, I gotta go this way. Oh, there's something under here. Yeah, more plaster. Nick? Whoa, Lily. Your dad was a really big fan of Nick from the mailroom. Well, most people are. Except my dad. My dad once told me he thought Nick John Smith was an obsequious little Lex Spittle. So Lex Nick Spittle? That's how my dad talked. My real dad. Raz, this isn't my dad's mind. This is Lily. Nick. So, Nick? What? Nick is the mole? Hey, you kids, get off that carpet. VIPs only. If it's not your dad's mind, whose mind is it? Is it Nick's? Yeah. Nick? Nick's brain is missing, but I mean, Nick? Make way, common folk. Make room for Zazarevich Crystal Malik, future Czar of Grolovia. Nick is the Zazarevich? I can't believe it. What's a Zazarevich? The missing heir to the throne of Grolovia. He lived in exile with his family after Maligula destroyed the capital. Why is his brain in your dad's body? And where is my father's real brain? Come on, let's make him talk. Come on, he's getting away. Move aside. Hey, no cut. You can't just cut in line. <clears throat> Coming through. Sorry, kids today. Oh. Hi. Can we get on the ride, please? Did you two cut in line? We're VIPs. Oh, does that stand for vertically impaired preteens? Oh, come on! This is an emergency! Uh, it's for your own safety. Come back when you're older. Okay, we're older. Check us now. Oh, man. How long have I had this job? I gotta get out of here. Sorry. Grolovians only. What? You can't... It's okay, Raz. Go! But, Lily... Don't worry. I have a plan. Now, hey, follow that czar. Okay.
of Grulovia. Never had a nation been more prosperous, its people more content. Never was a royal family more beloved than the Maleks, Tsar Theodore, Tsarina Rokor, and the young Zezarevich, Crystal. The nation looked forward to the happy day when Crystal Malik would legally and rightfully inherit his father's throne. But alas, that was not meant to be. The Tsar's minister of war and protector of the people, General Maligula, had aroused the jealousy of the warmongering Ford Crawler. What the? He led his mob of psychonauts to gang up on Maligula, drowning the brave warrior. Just when I thought I'd heard every version of this story. And drowning much of Grulovia in the process. Why didn't the Tsar help Maligula in her time of need? No one knows, but historians agree it is Tsar Theodore's biggest failure. In the end, Grulovia, the Maleks, and Maligula were betrayed by the weakness of the Tsar and the bloodlust of the Psychonauts. That is some messed up junk. <laughs> hey, Raz, I'm watching you on the control panel here. Why'd you stop? This door won't open. What happened to the ride operator? He, uh, had an accident. Hmm. Looks like there's an electrical problem up above the ride. Okay, I'll drain the water so you can get up there. If you can fix it, I should be able to get the ride going again from here. Check! Yeah, yeah, in my face. There we go. Uh huh. Yeah. Okay. Found the right one. How do you know for sure? <laughs> yeah, like Rad said, how are you? How are you sure? Girl, do negative things harder for me. Like, come on now. Fire, I wanna see. Oh, God. Oh, 
on the server. Okay. So no more. That's the right one. For murder. Okay, this is this is hurting my mind. I just because a lot of this stuff is not making no sense. Maligula was mourned. If only the Tsar had supported her more, not turned his back on her in her time of need. Maybe then his family would not have been forced into exile. Wander the earth with no country across the frozen Arctic. The burning desert. Endless ocean. They lived in the ocean. On his deathbed, Tsar Theodore gave young Gristle, who had suffered so much, a small ray of hope. maintenance uh, and uh, for the glory of Grilovia or whatever what's the hold up hang on I gotta talk to a guy about a door uh, excuse me but this door over here sorry busy busy with what propaganda nearing I'm creating a future chapter in this glorious semi-interactive location-based epic this treasure room tells the story of how once the Zazarovich finds Maligula and restores Grulovia to its former glory, the people will all share in unimaginable riches. But it's missing something. Not sure what. 
Like something to go in that big egg cup in the middle? Yeah, something there. Like maybe an egg? That's it! See? Sometimes you just need a fresh set of eyes. Hey, you get me a big, beautiful, luxurious egg, and I'll use my pass to open that door for you. Deal! Hey, where do they keep the big eggs around here? Crystal told me the best eggs he ever found were out in the ocean. Whatever that means. I think what this needs is some fish. Is this going to help me find my dad's brain? I want to change something else, I think. Figures. Okay, that's enough for now. Thanks, Lily. Bye, Roz. Okay, so I think I got it now. There you go. From here. Hey, I know where I am. This is the Lady Lucktopus. The Maliks must have lived at the casino for a while, suffering in exile. Ha! Why can't I? Oh, okay, okay, that's why. So, why can't What's up? Lily, there's a room here just like the one we found on the mission to the casino. The delusionist was Crystal. So, that's why Nick had a Luxopus key in his pocket. He was living there. Yeah, in exile. Ooh, that means he's the one who wrote the creepy note about me. He's here, Crystal. Really? Wait a second. Why the long face? My father died today. Oh. I'm sorry. Don't be. He ruined my life. And if it weren't for him, I'd be the Tsar of Grulovia. <laughs> Believe it or not. Instead, I'm homeless. I don't know. This place looks pretty nice. Ha! Good one. Hey, kid. There's... something about you I like. Are you... By any chance of Grulovian blood? Half. Half blood will have to do. <laughs> Come, and let us toast to the fatherland. Hey, want some caviar? That's it. Um... I don't know. I've never had caviar. That's okay. It's just eggs. Incredibly expensive eggs. Well, since you put it that way... You won't regret it. I mean, look at these eggs. Maybe I'll have just one. <laughs> I don't think one is gonna do the trick. We'll see. How did that even happen? Wait, what? How did that in the world that just happen out of nowhere? Well, okay.
Oh man, okay. Need some momentum. Oh no. Dang it. Okay. Oh, okay, I see. Messing up too much, y'all. Jesus. There you go. Whew. I'm on. before you break anything else. memory of stealing your father's brain. Does he show what he did with it? No, it's just a weird puppet show now. Hey, wait. 
I'm in this one. He found their organization ridiculously easy to manipulate. Some of their most trusted agents were mere children, easily controlled by Puppet Master Malice. Super creepy. It's not safe at all. Okay. At different shit. That's just for fun. Okay. Port is in session. Council must not badger the gavel. Oh, why didn't I stock up on side pots? Oh my god. I just want to find that heart and get back on the ride again. trunk tag for this guy. Lobato. This must be the moment where Lobato stole Agent Zanato's brain. Creepy. So Crystal Malik was the one who hired you to swap his brain in for Truman's? I'll never tell. I'm literally watching you do it right now. Where did you put Truman's brain? I'll, I'll never tell. tell. Come on! I'll, I'll never, never tell. tell. Oh, God. Okay. Ah! Of course. <laughs> Some weird stuff off the ride, and Raz, we're chasing Crystal Malik, remember? Not having fun at an amusement park. <sighs> I'm headed back to the cart now.
Let's see. A land without caviar. I guess he was scared of my little, you know, what she could do. He told her to kill her. Oh, okay, so he blamed, uh, so he blames, okay, so he blamed was psychomotic, so he feel like he gotta get malignant, but really, it was his fault and fault, that when she was on her little rampage thing, because he was trying to kill her from the get-go, so if he's mad at anybody, it should be his father. Mission code name I made for you. Oh, I like it. Let's go mash crystal. Hmm. Weird. What's that sound? So, what did you think? I think you're a very confused person, and you don't know what you're messing with. I'm going to restore a whole country to greatness. A country that your heroes, the Psychonauts, tore apart. Grulovia was never great. It was always a fair to middling country at best. Please. I was there. You weren't. It was amazing. I had a cotton candy maker in my bedroom. 
Where's Truman's brain? Not my problem. Your dad was a brutal dictator and a ruthless strongman. My father's only problem was that he wasn't strong enough. As Tsar, I won't have that problem. Trust me. The people hated the Maliks. If that were true, then why did they unanimously re-elect us every election? Your father used Lucretia Mux to squash nonviolent protests. Maligula rained on a few parades, yes? But that's what cooled them down before they got too violent. Tsar Theodore made a monster. He pushed a vulnerable young woman to do such horrible things in the name of her country that she snapped. He broke her. He took a sad country girl and turned her into a mighty warrior. And I'm going to do it again. Maligula is my grandma. <laughs> oh boy, now who's confused? I've had enough of this. Yes, me too. Hey, I'm not a puppet. I'll break out of this in two minutes and then you'll be sorry. That's all the time I need to have Truman extricate Maligula from her captors back in the physical world. No, please don't. She's in a very fragile state right now. Any stress or memories could... Could awaken the Guardian of Grulovia and fulfill all of my hopes and dreams? You don't say. Please excuse me. I don't want to miss this. Hey, you jerk! I'm gonna wreck this place. Oh, I didn't even see her. I just pressed the random. Come over here. Help. Ow. Look. <laughs> what? No, not that one. This one. Man, this is oh man, there's a lot going on, y'all. It's getting good, but man, I'm gonna edit a lot of this stuff, y'all. Were you children just inside the mind of the grand head of the psychonauts? No. Darling, we saw you come out. That's an incredible security violation. Listen, that's the mole! Kid, you're way behind. The mole is Nick from the mailroom. Sasha just figured it out. But I always had my suspicions. Why, there he is, over there. No, that's the Zazarovich of Grulovia. Or at least his body. His mind is in my dad's head. Ugh, we don't have time for this. Let's go get my dad's brain. Out of my way. Did she just say... Gah, I think we should get out of here. Little Zazarvich. Have you come to pay for your father's sins? Yes, High Priestess. I am here to correct the mistakes made by my father. 
I am Crystal Malek, son of Tsar Theodore, rightful ruler of Grulovia, and servant of Maligula. Lucy, this isn't you. We can fight this together. Ford, you are here too. This is awkward. Ah, there's too many people here. Too much baggage. Need to... Push it all away! Lily, wait! I'm gonna need some help. Oh, wow, yeah, there's a lot. <laughs> there's Is a lot. Maligula doing that? Of course she's doing that. Yep. Gonna need the family. Hello. Special. Come back anytime. All right. I hope my family is still at the camp. <laughs> Your father had a rough night. He's been remembering things. I lost her, Rasputin. You know what we have to do. Mio caro. No tears, my love. It's showtime. Time for the devil's fire hose. Quippy, on the bottom. isn't real, Dad. It's just something Ford put in our minds to keep us safe. You sure about that? Of course he's not sure. But what choice does he have? You ready, Raz? No. So do it quick. Yeah, 
there's a lot going on, man. Goodness gracious. Ooh oh, man, this is a long video. That's right, and there's more where that came from. Huh. All right, let me. Well, this is Cherry. My grandparents were part of the protests in Grulovia after the war. Didn't end well. Here's a scene I was hoping not to see again. You're in the way, Maligulugly. Maligulugly. Malugly. Yeah, I gotta practice that before I meet her for real. Grandma Morona. My real Grandma Morona. And my dad's father, Lazarus. Nice to see them alive, actually. Oh, so okay. Oh, no, I gotta burn it. I was like, so I'm confused. Oh. Uh. I'm gonna pay for that later. Uh, Nona? Oh, uh, hi. I'm Raz. I'm your great nephew. <laughs> I mean, not that I think I'm great or anything. Just see. You're my grandma's sister, and I'm here to talk you out of being evil because, you know, you're still family and all. Family? All I see is another unruly Grulovian peasant. A uh, half Grulovian. Another bit of trash and he divorced from the streets. <laughs> oh boy. Sam, two of you are no more threat than one. In my time, I have vanquished entire armies. Ding dong, Wheelogram! I'd like you to meet Mental Esmeralda. Uh oh. Careful, children. Oh, I fear a storm is coming. Hmm? <laughs> I am the deluge of Grolovia. No, no, no. Let the streets be cleansed. Uh oh. Okay. Yeah, it's gonna I'm be... not afraid of you. Your 
just an overgrown lust for violence and destruction. Okay, that sounded scarier than I wanted it to be. But you're actually a normal part of it. She's all twisted up in knots. I got something that'll help you. Unwind. Ooh, that looked painful. It's okay. I have another one. I bought a drink, but oh, I forgot about that. from that water.
to me, upset about some terrible mistake she had made. So we put the word out on KLOB, and guess what? People were listening! At least one of them, and they told the others. Thanks, Morris. You owe me an exclusive on-air interview for this, okay? You got it, buddy. So what's going on? Are we going to play a different spot? Or? <coughs> Marona wasn't supposed to be there. Lazarus shouldn't have brought her. He killed my sister. No, that's not quite right. No, that's not quite right. What do you listen? I... I killed my sister. I might not be your real grandmother. I killed my sister. But you're still my family. What's so that? Eh? <laughs> what? I kill lots of people. Oh wow. The only thing I can offer now is everything I've got. All right. Uh oh. Uh oh, uh oh, Jack, get it, Raz. Okay. Oh, I wish I had made you bigger. It's okay, Nona. Look behind her. Ah, my crawly doggy's little hole, after all. <laughs> yep, and we're gonna fill it. Oh god. Oh fire over. Oh that's so cool. Ooh. Mm. Mm. Come on. Mm. Nona, 
big deal. Everybody's got something like you. We just know how to keep it where it belongs. This is a lot to take in, y'all. Oh my god, it's a, it's a lot. Nona! Nona! Have a funnel. Shh, y'all, this is oh, this, this is a lot. This is a whole lot. So that's it. Maligula gets to live out in Green Needle Gulch with Ford as if she didn't just try to kill people. Hey, it was different when I did it. There was a monster, and and then uh, and now. Uh, I think she deserves a second chance. And I think I deserve a vacation. My brain's been through a lot. Oh, no you don't. I've kept this place afloat during your little nap. And now I'm taking two of the 17 weeks of vacation I've saved up to lie in a beach where none of you can find me. Right after we take care of some important Psychonauts business. Well, are you coming or not? Now that's leadership. Despite my best efforts, you interns have seen some really inappropriate things. But I think you've also learned a truth that every psychonaut should know. That there are flaws in our most venerated institutions, in our heroes, and in ourselves. We all make mistakes. And we all need help sometimes. We all deserve a second chance. You've seen us at our worst, and we've seen you at your best. And I'm proud to say you have all graduated from the intern program. Woo! Yes. That's what I'm talking about. You are all now officially junior agents of the Psychonauts. Junior? I'll take it. <laughs> he said, I don't care, Rassel, I don't care, I'm gonna be a second man. A junior, I don't care, he said, I'm a second man, that's all that matters. Whoa! I beat the game. I beat the game! Oh my god. Oh my god! Oh man, that was a lot, y'all. That was a lot. Oh man. I knew I graduated the intern program and all, but I'll bet if I snuck in a little extra credit work, that would really irritate Norma. Let's see. Out of spot. Congratulate oh, say, congratulations, Junior Psychonaut. A new auto shot filter finding collectible is now available at all auto matted machines. I mean matted machines if you haven't borrowed any gadgets yet for auto report. Okay. Excuse me. 
Excuse me, Agent Forsyth? Yes, Rasputin? I just wanted to apologize. No, no, no. I thought we agreed not to talk about that again. We did? Listen, in the end, I was the adult in the room. You were the child. I take full responsibility. And the whole thing is just so embarrassing, so let's just move the mission log to the classified file, okay? What are you doing out here? Well, just relaxing, waiting for my flight to the tropics. I'm off the clock, but I'm happy to answer any non-work-related questions. Where will you go on your vacation? Oh, well, Agents 9 and Vodella were nice enough to give me this all-expense-paid tropical vacation. Look. That thing's real? Well, it better be. That prescription sunblock I bought wasn't cheap. So, what will you do with Crystal Malik? Well, we don't want any publicity about it, or we'd have to give up malig- Lucretia. So we'll probably just keep Malik here. Maybe give him to Agent 9 for experiments. Experiments? You're going to experiment on Crystal? Heavens no! That's terrible. Why would you say such a thing? You said- I said we'd give him to Sasha for therapy. But- No one likes an argumentative preteen, Rasputin. <laughs> Will you miss being the acting head of the Psychonauts? Not a bit. In fact, my main goal now is to convince Truman to put off retirement as long as I can. He's been threatening me with the title of Grand Head for years. But I do not need the grief. Do you want Ford to come back and work at headquarters? Absolutely. Nobody gets my hair like Agent Crawler. What will you do with Lucretia? I'd like to keep her under observation. What about the government? The Grulovian secret police? Please! This is Psychonaut's business. I'll bet you're happy my family is leaving soon. Actually, I've invited them to stay. What? I see a lot of potential in that sister of yours, and your little brother, and even your father. Are you going to make my family into psychonauts? Well, we should at least teach them psycho safety. Can't have them running loose, leaving a trail of burning pine cones behind them. Well, have fun on vacation. Thanks, Rasputin. If I see an octopus while snorkeling, I'll think of you. Right before I shoot it with my spear gun. Okay, he's a little brother. Jose, so, so Queeby, Freezy, and his father is also have psychic powers. Interesting. All right, hold on a second, y'all. Before I really fully end this video, I just want to check stuff real quick, cause I am done. Like, I ain't gonna lie, y'all. I've been playing this for quite a bit. I'm just check on everything real quick. Hello, Agent Mentalis. Well, if it isn't my favorite customer. Make any new gadgets lately? Actually, I'm thinking of a whole new line of gadgets. Gadgets that open up the mind for exploration, like in the old days. Okay. Wasn't that dangerous the way you early psychonauts used to explore the mind? Seeing that old astrolathe really inspired me. I'm going to make tiny, personal-sized astrolathes to help people make small cosmetic changes to their personalities. Like how an injectable neurotoxin removes wrinkles, but uh, for the mind. I don't think it's a good idea to remove your mind's wrinkles. That's because you're a kid. Trust me, by the time you're my age, there will be plenty of wrinkles in that mind of yours you'll be happy to get rid of. Happy that Ford's back? You know, I missed that old abusive so-and-so. You need a guy around like that to keep you humble. Why is that? I don't know. It's just something Ford keeps telling me. Was it weird seeing your old friend Lucy again? You know, I was the one who brought Lucy here the first time, so I feel a little responsible. Really? No, not much. It was all Ford's fault. 
<laughs> What's gonna happen now with Ford back? Knowing Ford, things will get chaotic and we'll lose all our funding. But that's okay. I have a backup plan. To tell you the truth, I've been fighting off the venture capitalists for years. Maybe you should get out of this lonely lab. Ah, uh, I'm fine. I have my gadgets. And a pretty friendly crab sandwich scuttled by a while back. Crab sandwich. See you next time, kid. Ah, the Aquatodome. It's not big, but then again, neither were our audiences. I'm just happy that it's not made of meat. Uh, yep. yeah. oh. Okay, one more time. The Aquatos have had a long time feud with the Galokios. They were fortune tellers, and Papa said that's bad. He only said that because he thought the Galokios had cursed all Aquatos to die in water. But it's not true, and we're actually Galokios? We have two Galokio grandmas. Kind of. A real grandma, Marona. Who I never met! None of us did. And her sister, Lucretia, Arnona, who is also someone named Maligula. The big water funnel we beat up with Pooter. Yes! And our real grandpa is Gelson Mux? No, Gelson Mux is Nona's first husband. Nona, you and your secrets! But the poor guy died in the Grulovian Wars before she came here. And started dating the old bacon guy. Is he our grandpa? No. Anyway, she went back to Grulovia to help in the war, and that's when she became Maligula and accidentally killed our real grandma, Morona. That's so sad! It is. Everybody's sad about it, but it's better to be sad than to do what the bacon man did next. He tricked Papa and told him that Nona was his mama. He used a machine to trick Papa's mind from the inside. But Nona is our grandma. I mean, Nona! Not really, but if we want, kinda? If she wasn't our Nona, we couldn't call her Nona. Tella, that's not how this works. None of this makes sense. I don't get it. <sighs> nice chart. Raz, Frazy says Nona's not our Nona. Well, uh, it's a long story. You want to tell it? Oh, I, I would, but uh, I gotta go do some spy stuff. Bye. Hi, Mom. Putty, my middle baby. So glad you are here. Much work to do. What work? Now that you have lifted the evil curse on our family. I just pointed out that it was all in our minds. Yes, yes. You believe what you must believe. Either way, it opens up so many possibilities. This is going to be a new golden age of the Aquato family circus. Water axe? We will finally earn our name. Think Dad will be okay? Eventually. You know, I think there was a part of him that always knew. This may finally bring him peace. Why don't you go talk to him? He's probably up high somewhere, staring off into space. Handsomely. Did you know the truth about Nona? Well, she did always seem a little off to me. But I thought that was just a mother-in-law thing. We be lost again? You've taught me that sometimes you must let your children roam free. Because that's how we learn. Because they have psychic powers they can use to crush all who oppose them, hmm? I have some ideas for water acts. I'm listening. Underwater tightrope? Not dangerous enough. Try again. Trapeze over shark tank. How do we transport sharks, Rasputin? Next idea. Wet blanket fighting. Terrible. Next? Dog washing. Ugh, what else? On second thought, never mind. You've convinced me to avoid collaboration for the time being. I'm gonna get back to my important spy stuff. Don't forget to check on your father, Mr. Big Man of the World. 
All right. Now, where is... Hey, Dad. Hello, son. How do you feel about Nona now? How can I answer that? She's at the center of so many painful events. But in the end, she might be the one who suffered the most. How are you doing? I'm not quite sure. So many things to think about. Are your memories changing? I don't even know which memories are mine. I have memories of my mother from before she died, and I miss her. But I also have a lifetime of memories with Nona. It's giving me a bit of an identity crisis. Tell me about your identity crisis. Well, memories are stories we tell ourselves about where we come from. It's how we figure out who we are. And the story I've been telling myself all my life is a lie. Are you mad at Ford? I feel tricked and confused. But that man, he's put himself through enough. What are you going to do now? I think I'm going to let this whole mess simmer for a bit in the back of my mind while I focus on making some new stories for the family. So, is Nona still in the family? Well, she's still our blood, Rasputin. And she always will be. As far as where she'll live now, that's up to her. She's with Ford right now in the Green Needle Gulch, trying to answer that very question. Okay. What about the circus? Oh, son, that's going to be something now. The Aquatos have some great water tricks we haven't used in a generation. It's time for the Aquatos family circus to rise again. You feel like you're free of the water curse? Oh, yes. I feel great about it now. Later today, I'm thinking we should all go for a swim. That little army fellow offered to give us all swimming lessons. Okay. I'll leave you alone. I never mind talking to you, son. We psychics understand each other, right? Oh, that's good. All right. Wait, wait, wait. What could you two have to talk about? Not you, if that's what you're worried about. Your brother has some ideas about psychics. Did you know that psychic powers don't come from drinking human blood? Uh, yes. What else did you learn, Dion? Did you know fortune tellers didn't actually invent bed bugs? Give me one more. Crystal balls aren't actually fortune teller eggs. Actually, I still half believe that one. Dion, where did you get all these weird ideas about psychics? Dad? Queepy told me most of them. Oh, I get it now. Gisu, why are you wasting time with this guy? Don't you have important intern, uh, stuff to do? Here's the issue. My mentor, Otto Mentalis, deployed several psycho seismometers like this one to detect and collect negative psychic residue. Problem is, he kind of forgot about them for a long time. So now, they're all overloaded and unstable. I thought, instead of me going around venting all these nasty things and stealing all the glory... You want me to do it? For extra credit, you're welcome. And to free me up for more high-minded engineering work. Okay, come on, rep. Wait, you said yes? All right, good man. <laughs> well, if you survive, be sure to report back, okay?
Dr. Lobato, where do you think you're going? The green man told me to wait in the brain bumbler. That's not the brain tumbler. Oh, I guess I'm escaping then. Bye! Please don't tell. You know I'm a reformed man. You were there. You saw me. Hmm. Plus, I need to get back to camp. I left my kid there. Wait, what? You have a kid? Yeah. What? Hi there. Cross your in. my mind. But I want you to know that in my heart, you are my grandson. My second favorite grandson. Well, that certainly sounds like something my Nona would say. What are you two going to do now? We're going to recuperate here for a bit. <sighs> Make sure Lucy's okay. Oh, I'm fine! Thanks to little Queepy here. Think you'll come back to work at the mother lobe, Agent Crawler? Well, I need to spend at least a little time there, or else those bowling alley shoes are gonna sprout legs and walk away. But I'd also love to take Lucy to Whisper and Rock. He thinks if he gets me on the canoe at sunset that I won't be able to resist his advances. <laughs> okay, that's enough. He's right. Okay! What's next for the Psychonauts, Agent Crawler? Well, I'm not sure, but uh, if I have any influence, we'll get back to basics. Exploring the human mind. There's still so much mystery to explore there, Rasputin. If you're going to give your final frontier speech, I'm going to close my eyes and sleep for a bit. <sighs> you <laughs> keep talking. Well, I thought it was interesting. Have you talked to my dad yet? Not yet. Do you, uh, think he'd talk to me? I think my dad will need a little time. But, you know what they say about acrobats. They They're very flexible. They bounce back. <laughs> well, I hope both are true. I'll leave you two alone. Stay away from the water! Oh, sorry. <laughs> Old habit. All right, Black Wolves, this is the end of the video. I was going to try to go ahead and find my little brother, um, Queeby, and find uh, True Man and Lily, but I'm going to be honest, y'all, uh, like, I tried, <laughs> and I couldn't really find them, so I feel like, well, I'd rather just find, try to find them later on, whatever, in my own spare time, and do all the extra side crap you know things like that but anyway like i said that is it i beat psychonauts y'all that is it um i will have a review very soon so definitely stay tuned for that and go ahead hit the like the bell subscribe and i say this all in my other video all of my other videos if you haven't already subscribed please go ahead and do so so you can join the 917 wolfpack this is a fun kickback gaming channel which has the greatest community in the world which is you guys the black wolves so go ahead and spread words to your friends and family who likes gaming so they can go ahead and join the wolf pack because everybody's welcome to the pack and like i said just stay tuned for the second nuts to review and i'll tell y'all my next game to play and this and that and that's it all right, guys. I love y'all. Peace. God bless y'all. TGDS 9197. Out.